Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Friday, March 5th, 2021. Free pick coming up in just a moment. First quick note, if you've yet to become a member over at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, click on that link below the video, get yourself set up for a free $60 account, which you can then use on any of my daily packages or anybody else on the roster over at DocSports.com. Again, it all starts by clicking on the link below the video. Hey, big day yesterday. We've had a real nice week yesterday. Yesterday, we cashed the six-star play in college basketball with the Dayton Flyers. Nice double-digit win over Rhode Island. Uh, we also had a seven-star play in the NHL, and after a slow start by the Flyers, they came storming back and got the win for us. Real good day yesterday. Uh, we also cashed, by the way, uh, in, in the PGA. We cashed in soccer. We cashed in the NBA. Final day before the All-Star break, we finished up winning all five of those plays, those premium plays yesterday. So let's keep it going today. On Friday, I got a five-star play in college basketball, five-star KO, as we like to call them. Uh, and we are up now over $5,100 on our current run with college basketball sides. Uh, I do have a six-star play in the NHL. We are now 10 and two with our last 12, seven and six-star plays on the ice. And that includes yesterday's seven-star winner with the Flyers. Uh, so big plays. Again, college basketball, five-star, uh, NHL, six-star. Uh, going to take a pass today in soccer. We'll be back on Saturday. Saturday, though plenty of games that we want to sink our teeth into and then also wanted to mention we got a four-star play in golf early Friday and uh, listen we cashed again yesterday in golf as I mentioned we're now 40 and 29 on our current PGA run with matchups up over $2,600 so check out uh, that matchup in Friday's round two action cashed yesterday with a five-star play so there you go and again the stars of the show five-star college baskets six-star NHL let's look to stay red hot in all three of those sports. Uh, all right, let's get to it. Free pick for today, by the way. Obviously, there won't be any NBA videos for a while because uh, they are off until uh, next Wednesday, the 10th of March, uh, due to the All-Star break. So we'll jump back into videos of the NBA at that point. Uh, but right now, it's a Mountain West battle on Friday night between Colorado State and Nevada. Listen, I, I see this Nevada Wolfpack program slowly eroding under Steve Alford. Didn't like what he did at UCLA. Uh, we've seen... You you know what UCLA has done since Cronin has come in uh, and now I watch this team up in Reno and you watch them on TV and you see a team that's nowhere near where Eric M Musselman had built this program and taken them to uh, the fundamentals aren't quite there I know they've got some trends and angles that go on their side tonight but we're gonna back Colorado State here they're laying a point as we speak and when you look at Nevada just in the last couple of games for instance against Utah State uh, they were blown out basically in both games they were down by 20 one at one point in the second half in the first meeting against Utah State uh, but they came roaring back and the score looked a lot closer in the game they got within three ended up losing the contest and then they came up against Utah State the very next game uh, just a few days ago and instead of having revenge on their mind and some motivation to get off to a great start they got blown out start to finish by Utah State they were down by 13 less than 10 minutes into the game and ended up losing the contest by 21 some interesting stats from that Nevada hustle stats not there they had one offensive rebound in that second meeting against Utah State they gave up 17 they were out rebounded overall uh, 47 to 24 and listen Utah State went just four of 22 from the three-point line still piled up 87 points on the 21 point win and as far as Colorado State is concerned I like him to get the victory here I look at what Colorado State does as far as their metrics real good on the defensive end uh, 58th in the nation in fact an effective field goal percentage on defense they they are seventh in the entire country in effective field goal percentage on the offensive end. They are sixth in the nation shooting two pointers, 37th shooting threes. They also defend the three point line quite well. And uh, they got a lot to play for here. They can win the conference. They're 17 and four overall right now. We're going to back Colorado State on the road over Nevada on Friday night. Again, don't forget the big card for us starts with golf early Friday. Uh, we look to go to 41 and 29 in golf, go up over $3,000 uh, for $100 per unit betters in golf and then of course we got the six star in the nhl the five star in college basketball uh, all right if you like the videos click on the thumbs up button be sure to subscribe i do appreciate those who have done so thus far i'm scott spritzer docsports.com let's put friday in the win column